Today we'll be discussing the best things to do in Seoul, South Korea. South Korea's dynamic capital is a mesmerizing blend of ancient traditions and modern marvels. Join us as we explore the best things to do in this captivating city. Day 1, Journey Through History Day 1 begins with a deep dive into Seoul's rich history. Our first stop is the awe-inspiring Gyeongbok Palace, the largest and most grandiose of the five grand palaces. Tip 1 is to arrive early for the changing of the grand ceremony at Gwangwamun Gate, the captivating display of tradition and precision. After exploring the palace, stroll through Bukshon Hanok village where you'll find well-preserved traditional Korean houses known as Hanoks. Don't forget to indulge in some delicious Korean street food like sweet pancakes and spicy rice cakes from the local vendors. Day 2, Modern Marvels. Day 2 is all about embracing Seoul's modern side. Start your day with a visit to the futuristic Dongdaemun Design Plaza, an architectural masterpiece in the heart of the city. Make sure to explore Dongdaemun's vibrant shopping district, which is open 24-7, where you can find everything from fashion to electronics. For a taste of Seoul's contemporary art scene, head to the Liyum, Samsung Museum of Art, where you'll discover an impressive collection of Korean and international artworks. And finally, cap off your day with a visit to the iconic Namsan Seoul Tower. You can reach it via a cable car or simply by hiking up Namsan Mountain. Day 3 is exploring culture and tradition. So your third day is a cultural immersion experience. Begin at the National Museum Museum of Korea, where you'll find a treasure trove of artifacts that span centuries of Korean history. Check the museum's schedule for traditional cultural performances, including traditional music and dance. Next, make sure to explore In Sedong, which is a neighborhood known for its traditional tea houses, artisan shops, and antiques. For a truly immersive experience, participate in a traditional tea ceremony and savor the delicate flavors of Korean tea. Day 4 is Korean food and markets. Day 4 is really a feast for the senses. Begin your culinary adventure at Gwangjang Market, one of Seoul's oldest and most famous markets. A helpful tip, don't miss out on the market's signature dish, which is mung bean pancakes, and explore the bustling food stalls for a variety of delectable Korean dishes. And after indulging in your taste buds, make your way to the vibrant Namdaemun Market, known for its shopping bargains and lively atmosphere. Take time to explore the market's narrow alleyways, where you'll find clothing, electronics, and souvenirs at fantastic prices. Day 5 is simply a nature escape. Escape the urban hustle and embrace Seoul's natural beauty. Start your day at the serene Changdaegung Palace, a UNESCO World Heritage Site famous for its stunning secret garden. Helpful tip is to book a guided tour to explore the secret garden, a lush oasis in the heart of the city. Continue your nature-themed day with a visit to the Bukonsan National Park, where hiking trails offer breathtaking views of the city. Make sure to wear comfortable shoes and pack water and snacks for your hike in this national park. And there you have it, our whirlwind tour of the best things to do in Seoul. Whether you're delving into history, exploring modern marvels, immersing yourself in culture, savoring delicious cuisine, or escaping to nature, Seoul offers an array of experiences that will leave you enchanted. We hope this guide inspires your own adventures in Seoul and that it helps you create lasting memories in this amazing city. And if you're ready to turn your travel dreams into reality and explore the wonders of Seoul and beyond, consider unlocking your journey with Embarks. Embarks offers exclusive exclusive travel deals and personalized assistance to make your trips unforgettable. Join us on this journey at Embarks.com. And until next time, happy travels.